Hi everyone, welcome to Saturday Morning Manx. Started by Jill Norwood, she um, wanted a crafty time, so she set aside an hour on Saturday and in, to craft and inspired all of us to share our crafts every week, so thank you. And so this week I had went to the Dollar Tree and got this really cute um, stocking here with a gingerbread on it. And I wanted to um, embellish it more. It said cheers across here, which I didn't like. And so you can always take something and make it your own and have fun with it. And I just love creating and making things that I, taking things that I have and making a project with it and seeing it completed. So I'm really pleased with this. I used some Nuvo glitter pens to color them in, which I didn't, which I've already put away, but here, I'll get them out for you. And they're here, these, this is the blue one, it's the Nuvo glitter markers, and it says smooth flowing glitter marker pen, which um, I used on the tree, the gingerbread, and then um, the snowflakes, and um, the printed ones there, and um, then I used some of these Nuvo glitter drops that I like. This one is the crystal drops. The red one's the crystal drops. And then this green one is the glitter drops. The green one is called Sun Sunlit Meadow. The red one is called Red Berry. And this white one is White Blizzard. White Blizzard glitter drop. So, yeah, I used those. I used... A combination of stickers and gems that I had and so and I had this applique piece that I'm pretty sure came from Goodwill and like a bag of applique pieces and I've had it for quite some time I used to take my girls to Goodwill in the summertime just for like a treasure hunt I would give them two dollars each and they could see what they could find when I dropped off my donations so they just loved that and they called it a treasure hunt so, I think, pretty sure this came from one of those times that I had picked this up. So, it says that it was $2.39 at Walmart and marked down to $1.40, but like I said, I did not buy this at Walmart. I got it at the Goodwill in a big package with other ones. So, pretty, pretty cool. It says elegant, seasonal. So, it's like an iron-on type thing but really cute on here, and I think, and then I had also got these Jolie stickers in a big pack at Goodwill again, and um, just happened to be lucky enough to get a huge pack of somebody had donated all these Jolie stickers that they had decided that to pass on, and um, it was like $20, which is kind of expensive for Goodwill, you know, but considering they were Jolie's and see this $3.99 and they were super nice so I had got this in this pack and I thought oh okay I have a huge well not a huge I have okay I'll flip you around here to this floor this big toe here and it's full of Christmas so I dug around in there and found that I found these and they had the Santa hats I used the Santa hats out of that pack so and I put them on the gingerbread, and I think they fit pretty good and look pretty cute there. Then I found, and then I also used these snowflakes. Um, they came out of that same pack. So jo Jolie snowflakes, I used three of those. So then I used three of these snowflakes from this Jolie's pack. And then I used three of these snowflakes, which my mom actually got me these years ago, and I have just never used them, and now I'm so excited I used them all. So, that was three different snowflakes times three. That's nine snowflakes. Then I used these snowflakes off this sheet, the sticker sheet here. And I got this at my local scrapbook store. It might be American Crafts, but I couldn't tell you since it's out of the package. And I also use some leaves, branches, and a heart, and a holly jolly. 
And then, I, before I did that, I also used this ribbon here that came with a card kit that I didn't use. And it's sticky back. So I just cut off how much ever I wanted and stuck it on. Stuck it on the... On the um, stocking there. I thought about using these, but I did not. And that was in that Goodwill pack too, because I did not buy those at Hobby Lobby. So yeah, I got pretty lucky this summer and got that big pack. I had shared the Halloween one and then went back the next day because I was like, I wonder if they still have some of those. And got the big one with the gems and jewelry stickers, which I had not previously seen. So pretty awesome find there because a lot of those jewelry stickers you cannot get anymore. So yeah, I struck it. And then this I didn't show earlier. But this is the side of that tote. It's so cute. It says Baking Spirits Bright with a little hot cocoa cup and the cookies all around it. I just love that. And the mug I had got. It's taller than I thought it was. And I took it out of the box and it's 12 ounces. So I'm thinking that I see I put, I put stuff in it from the craft room. I put these little date stamps in there. I think I'm just going to keep those in my craft room because as like storage and just cute decor because I want to decorate more in gingerbread in here for the upcoming rest of the year. It's just bright and cheery and holly and I've just been needing that. So, okay guys, I still have all the little men in there. I put those away, but I wanted to share this for Saturday morning makes. And, um, here's my, my super cute, I love it, my super cute, um, stocking. Here, I'll try to set up for you. Maybe I will get that tripod set up sometime soon. So, there you go. I really think it turned out cute, so... Okay, we'll see you later, guys. Bye.